Welcome to my video on how to take a screenshot in Windows. I need to take a screenshot to prove that I did the work for this imaginary assignment. The first step is to take my screenshot. To get to the screenshot utility, you can come down here and click type to search. And then you're going to type the snipping tool. Once it pops up, you can click it. And this will give you the snipping tool. We can see we have a couple options here. We can click new and we can change the mode. We can also put a delay. As I just need to take a new picture, I'm going to click new. But first I wanna make sure that I have everything ready. This isn't what I wanna take a screenshot of. I wanna take a screenshot of this. It's pretty neat. I'm gonna to navigate to what I want to take a screenshot of, bring my snipping tool back up and click new snip. Notice how my screen grays out. This means that it is ready to take a screenshot. I'm going to click and then drag. Whatever I click and drag, it's going to be my screenshot. There's a little red box around it. But I only want to take a picture of a small bit or a large bit. When I'm happy with what I want to take a picture of, I can let go. This will bring up a preview of my screenshot. The next step is I need to save my screenshot. I could uh, leave a note like by uh, drawing. I can change the color. Um, up here. I don't need to do that though. I just need to take the screenshot. So I'm going to uh, take a new screenshot so I don't have that drawing in there. It's now time to save. I can come over here to the save snip and click it. Now it's time to pick a good spot for it. I'm taking a picture so for me it makes sense to put it over in my pictures tab. Wherever you save it, you need to remember that so you can find it in a little bit. Next thing we need to do is give it a name. I'm going to name it Polyhedra. Once I hit save, it is now saved and I can close my snipping tool. Next, I'm going to navigate to the assignment I need to turn that screenshot in on. I'm going to come over here and click add or create. And then I'm going to click file. When I click file, it'll take a moment and then it'll give me the option to browse. The screenshot I took is on the computer I'm on right now. It's not on the internet. This step will put it onto the internet. All right, now I need to navigate to where I saved it. I didn't save it in documents. I saved it in pictures. I can see my picture. I can click it and say open. It will now upload the picture. When I want to double check that the picture is the one that I wanted to upload, so I'll click it. Yep, that looks great. Uh, before clicking turn it in, I want to check uh, my picture against the rubric to make sure I'm satisfying any criteria and that it is the right thing. Then I can click turn it in.